What is up guys, today I will show you how in 2024 summer, right now it's August and I'm ready to show you the working method to unlock your scooter, your 9bot, F2+, Plus, F2 Pro, F2 and all the other version of 9bot scooters, how to do it in summer 2024. So let's check it out, actually I already unlocked my scooter and I will show you now how it will look like when it's unlocked. I have the master control version is 1.4.15, it's the latest one, the Bluetooth and battery option also the latest, as you see here it's already like the latest update here, if I click check for update nothing is happening and actually that's the working method how you can do it right now in summer 2024. Um, so let's check it out. Actually, as you see here, my scooter is visible here as Kick Scooter F2 Pro, but actually it's F2 Plus because I use a method that I showed in my previous video of the, uh, changing one letter from serial number and I changed it successfully. And uh, as you see here, I have 32 km per hour visible here, although I've got a cruise mode also visible here. And Currently this method is not available, so the another method is available. Firstly, what you need to do is to be sure that uh, your scooter actually is uh, closed to the app Segway 9 bot. So basically your scooter should be turned on, then you just close the app, you hold it up, you find the app control, depends on your phone, only on Android you can do it because this app, Sal Dash app is available only for Android. You click first stop here and check your scooter, you shouldn't have any like indicator that, uh, that uh, is connected by Bluetooth. So I will check it out, now I don't have anything here. So the next step you need to download the Sal Dash app here, you need to install it. So I'm installing it right now, it will not take that much time, it's really light application, but again only available on Android, in case you have iPhone, just get from your friend or it took some old phone um, or your parents phone and do it, it will take only like 5 10 to 10 minutes to fix it. So I'm installing it right now, then open mm, while using the app, allow. Welcome to Sour Dash. Okay, you have a device, click on it, then you will have some instructions. Okay, disclaimer, please press the power button of the scooter a few times for authentication. Let's press, agree. Okay, just pressed one time, you hear the noise, so that was the noise of the scooter. So I press the button and currently what I have here uh, is the uh, Settings, what can I do here? What can I activate? Like cruise control and sport mode, coast mode, and all the others. As you see, many functions available here. And what you need to do is go to basic here. As you see, already have top speed. But if you don't have, you have 25 kilometers per hour that is limited by default. You have an option here, unlock higher speed in S. So, that's the option that you're looking for, you need to turn it on, oh wait, I click it two times, you need to turn it on and although you need to change star speed to zero. Okay, I don't have this option because I don't have global zero, but okay, even now it's changed, you see I have a zero. Then after you finish it, uh, you need to check it out, you need to check the speed. So basically how you can do it, you can go outside or just go to your scooter, let me do it. So as you see it's connected, it's in the parking mode, drive, you need to change the speed here, put your wheel up and try the speed. So now I exit the mode, put my wheel up and try it. 32, yeah I had 32 before but you will have 30. Also the start speed you can change because you can keep uh, any speed that you need. It's just for testing. So now it's in the parking mode again. So as you see here, you can put the start speed again to three as it was by default. You will see only uh, available in global version, but as you see it works fine. 
And if you want to revert it, you just disable this thing and close it simply. Okay, let's let me enable it. Let me show you that I will be back to the normal. So after all of this, uh, what you need to do is click disconnect. So you see on the bottom here, disconnect, close the app and you can go back to the regular app, nine bot app. Just wait, it will find the scooter. Let me see whether it's turned on. Yes, yeah, turn on. Okay, need to click pair again. Let's click one time. All right, so you are connected back to the original app. Everything's working. You have 32 km per hour or 30, depends on your version, but that's a way that you can do it right now in summer 2024. And I really recommend to use it. I really recommend to do it. It will be much faster. And in case you don't need it, you can just use driving mode and without any problems. So for basically for this hack, that's pretty much it. I will also record another video in case this hack doesn't work for you. I'll make one more video, which second hack that works in 2020 and works perfectly so just uh, put the thumbs up leave the comments below and wait for the new video and I hope this video is working for you as it's working for me and many friends of mine and in case it works just leave a comment below that it works so many people will know that this method is still working right now doesn't matter which year and time it is all right thank you all right for watching put the thumbs up and see you next time